guys and welcome back to my channel. So today we are doing our monthly unboxing of the Honeybee Shop Babe Box, which is a planner and planner accessory subscription box from the Honeybee Shop, which is one of my favorite small businesses. So I'm really, really excited to get into this. Um, normally this packaging is like a silver holographic and this month it is gold because it matches with the theme. So let's get into it. Da, da, da. So as usual, the mailman shoved it in the mailbox, even though it didn't fit and the papers are bent, but you know, it's gonna be okay. All right, let's just pull everything out. Now I will go ahead and give a heads up. If you are somebody who watches my babe box unboxings every month, which if you are, I appreciate you, um, but I will not be having one for the month of September because I skipped that babe box. Um, because I wanted to put that money towards some more Halloween releases and the bait box theme for next month is just not really up my alley and I didn't really have anyone I wanted that I talked to who wasn't already getting it to gift it to so I decided to save my money on that and I'm gonna put it towards some Halloween releases so just a heads up but um, my friend Scarlett does unboxings um, on her channel of the bait box and I will see if she's getting it and if she is I will let you guys know uh, to go watch hers and I will have some different unboxings here for you so where do we begin okay let's start here okay so we have two journaling cards this first one says mind of a queen heart of a warrior and then this has the beautiful queen babe on here with the two skin tones and I want to tell you a little bit about this box. So the theme of this month's box is planner royalty. And it starts at the top with, this big box is super special to me as it features a collaboration with my best friend, Cindy from the Queen P. I had the pleasure to travel out to Virginia to work beside Cindy to curate this sophisticated yet playful box that empowers the queen that you truly are. I'm truly blessed to have gained this amazing relationship with Cindy, and it's true. Planner friends do make the best friends. She constantly makes me feel like planner royalty, and we want to know you are too. And that note is from Shan, who is the owner of the Honeybee Shop. And yeah, so this is a collaboration babe box with the Queen P, which you can also follow on Instagram. And the Queen P is a shop where you can buy stuff from her, from Cindy. So definitely go check that out. Um, and I, ooh, so here's the washi tape. I think this is really cute. So it has little crowns on it with gold foil. Super cute. And we're gonna open this up. I love that it's a black washi, which is kind of different from what we normally get. Ooh. All right, so this is our washi rolled out. A little swatch for you. Super, super cute. I think I have my, yep, my washi, washi buddy right here. Super cute, right? All right, so that is our washi tape. Then we have, these are so cute. These are little peas. And I think they are adorable. They're little like pea characters. So I'm gonna open these. Clear background on this first sheet. So <laughs> they're super cute. We have little happy peas and little geeky pea at the at the computer. Angry. Uh yeah, these are really cute. Then we have, oh, I love this. Yes, all three skin tones. We have a girl taking a selfie and she's doing a little peace sign there super cute and again all three skin tones which i love great to share with friends too she gets so many oh this is pretty so this is an enamel pin and i love the little heart backing card and it has that same when you don't have to be player famous or you don't have to be <laughs> Player famous when you're player royalty. I think that's awesome. It's a really pretty pin. I definitely want to check this out. Oh yeah. Oh, super pretty. I love it. Oh my gosh. And we're gonna put it on this. This I think was a really cool idea 
um, something really different, more of like a lifestyle product, but I think this is great. And this is something that I don't have something I can uh, use. Hopefully I can use it again. If I ever can travel again, this is a luggage tag. If you can't tell, and it's really freaking cool because it has these holes in it so you can put pins. So let's start with this one. All right, so then you have your little pin on your luggage tag, and then you can slide your ID or your card or whatever here in the back. You can put more pins here. Yeah, super cute. I love, I love this. I think it's um, just something totally different, something not really planner related, but you could use this. I um, mean, it doesn't have to be a luggage tag. I mean, you could put this on your book bag or your purse um to you know if you want to like go in a store and just not have to bring your whole wallet or something and you just need your um your debit card or whatever you could just slide that in the back so i think that's really cool and the pin looks great on it obviously you don't need to use you don't have to put a pin in it but i think it looks really cute so luggage tag with pin super cute and very high quality as well very luxe very high quality Oh, what do we do first? Um, let's do the die cuts. Y'all know if you've watched my unboxings before how much I love these die cuts. And I'm obsessed with the black and white stripes on this card. And I'm keeping this backing card because I love, I love black and white stripes. Might have something to do with, you know, late. Uh, Black Parade era, you know. All right, so here's our die cuts. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Ooh, -hoo -hoo. okay. Okay, so the first one here is a little B and I think this is just so freaking adorable. Oh my God, I love it. If you've never watched one of my unboxing videos um, and you don't know anything about the bait box, just so you know, these die cut stickers are waterproof and they're really high quality um i don't know what kind of paper they use for these but they are they are really high quality you can put them on your you know your travel mug like a coffee mug a water tumbler you can put it on your laptop on your planner cover whatever um but it's great that they're waterproof and i have tested that many times they definitely are but with these ones with the um foil i will say that over time the foil does get kind of like scratched um and kind of like fades when you have it on a cup and you're you know you're hand washing the cup and it definitely does um get kind of you know tattered if you will but yeah so this says find your inner peas with the little p so cute i love that Mind of a queen, heart of a warrior. Love that. Oh my God, look at her. We got a girl with some thick thighs. She's got her planner. She's got her tattoos. She's everything. Protect your peace. Absolutely love. Very relevant as of late. Here's another girl with her little designer planner cover there. Her shirt says planner royalty. She's got a little cup with the P on it. She's got P earrings. It's the details for me. Be the light in others lives. I love this. Um, the proofreader and grammar geek in me wants to write a little apostrophe after others because there should be one, but I'm sure you guys won't care. Um, <laughs> this is the same as the other one, just in the light skin tone. Another Mind of a Queen, Heart of a Warrior. Another skin tone. Another skin tone of the Find Your Inner Peas. Real Queens Fix Each Other's Crowns. Love it. And then we have these girls, the two um, other skin tones. Same one I showed before. This one literally just looks like Shan. Doesn't if you know if you know Shan from the Honeybee Shop, this just looks like her. It's got her tattoos and 
her the outfit and everything. It's just so much like Shan. I love it. Same thing here. Be the light in others' lives. I am obsessed with this design. I saw this in the digital. So when you get the Babe Box, you get digital files that you can print at home, uh, you know, unlimited amount of times. And this was one of them. And I, I'm obsessed with this design. I just think it's so pretty. I love everything about it. Um, the outfit is everything. The tattoos, the little bees flying around. Her, d everything. I love it. This might be my favorite design so far. And this, oh my gosh. I mean, is she not gorgeous? Like, the fuck? Then we have a little P. So cute. Yes. And we have the queen here. And then the other skin tones. Oh, I didn't realize there was different. So there's one with the, like the B outfit and one with the P out. Oh, come on. Are you serious? So this is like Honey Bee Shop and this is the Queen P. So cute. Seriously, look at that. Oh my gosh. These are so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay. I saw these in the digitals. I love this design. What I will say, which I know obviously like there would be so many different combinations. You couldn't do them all, but I really wish there was one with a dark skin tone and a light skin tone because that would be me and queen. Like if it was, if it was like these two, <laughs> oh gosh, it's, yeah, but this is such a cute design. Planner friends make the best friends. Adorable. I love that it's like a bigger die cut. You get three of them. Super, super cute. Um, and then we have a little gold foil bee, which is really, really pretty. Might give that to my mom. She loves bees. And then we have some little crowns. Very cute. Love these die cuts, and I'm super excited to use them. Okay, I'm going to do the papers, and then we're going to do the sticker book last. So since my mailman, you know, shoved it in the mailbox, as he's been doing every month, I will have to put something heavy on this to flatten it out, but I've had no problem flattening these out in the past. So this, uh, these are the pattern papers, and these can be used for creating dividers for your planner, like dashboards. Um, you can make bookmarks out of them. You could cut them up and, you know, there's all kinds of applications. But um, I do have a video here on my channel on how I use these papers to make dashboards and dividers for my catch-all planner, which is Disbound. I'll put a link in the cards and in the description um, so you can check that out. I love getting the papers because it allows me to customize my planner. And when I get sick of a theme, I can just take it out and replace it with something new and just kind of cycle through them. And they're two-sided and I love this black and white stripe side. I'm so excited about that. You also get these papers in the digital format, which is really cool if you have a printer at home um, because you can print these off to make more. So you get two of each design. So then we have green crowns ooh, and then gold foil stripes that's really really pretty and then we have crown vellum really pretty and then planner royalty acetate oh my gosh how cute is this going to be in a traveler's notebook like oh my god so yeah these are very very pretty i'm sorry that they're bent um it's not my fault but i will definitely flatten them out probably put my washi drawer my washi organizer thing on top of these to flatten them out. Okay, and last but not least, the sticker book. This is what I'm most excited for because I feel like this green color on the blackout inserts from Lights Planner Action, y'all, that's gonna be fire. I am so excited to do that and I might go ahead tonight and even uh, do my layout for next week and get ahead of that. 
because I'm so excited to use this. Okay, so first page of the sticker book. Love it. I love these. Oh my God, I'm obsessed with the stripes. This is so pretty. I love this because you have the one gold foil crown in the center. You can tell on camera. Yes. So you can see that the one crown in the center is gold foil and then the rest of them around it are black, which I think is really cool. Uh, Real queens fi fix each other's crowns, protect your peace. So same quotes from the die cuts, obviously. Um, you don't have to be planner famous when you're planner royalty. Yes. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited to do a layout with these. Okay, so you have my favorite girl on this page with her cute bee outfit. Oh my gosh, just <sighs> look at that. Yes. All right, so we got some functional checklists. <sighs> I just, I love stickers like this. You can, you can layer them, you can use them, you know, to be functional. You can write whatever you want on these boxes here. I just, yeah, I'm really excited to use those. And these love, the bubble boxes, the little quarter boxes here, the half boxes. I just, the stripes, I'm obsessed with the black and white stripes. Oh my God. The day oh my God. The black and white stripe day covers. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? Look, Jesus. Oh my God. I'm so excited. I cannot wait to use these. These are going to my planner next week. Absolutely. Um, and then we have another set of date covers with the green and the black and the gray. Really pretty. I love all the to-dos because I'm always using them. And then you have these, which you can write on top of. You could use them for layering. These you can use um, to, you know, track like for the week because it has seven boxes. You could track, you know, drink however many ounces of water and then every day that you do it you could check on that day there's many different ways to use this you could flip it vertically and use it um you could cut it you know and just use it as like a checklist and cut that white part off there's a lot of different things you could do um and then i love that you have this week errands and next week these we have our little icons um i will say as somebody who subscribes to the bait box pretty much every month I'm getting a little burnout on these. I have so many of them and I will never use them all. I just have so many. Now it is great because I can tear, tear it out and put it in with some happy mail for someone who doesn't have them. But you know, if you get the bay box every month, it's um, there's a lot of these that I just know I will never use. Now I do use a lot of them pretty frequently. I use the little sparkle one a lot. I use the Instagram one, um, the alarm one, this little film one, um, the bow I do use sometimes, the game controller I use all the time. I love that one. Please never remove that one. Um, <laughs> but there's a lot of them that I know I'm never going to use. So, but I can always share that with a friend, but I just will say I have so many of these <laughs> that it's getting a little, it's getting a little ridiculous how many of these I have. But it is nice to have gold foil because I haven't had that in a while. And they are clear as well. Okay, so here we have... Here, let me... So I've noticed this and I keep forgetting to say something. I, I just, I bet no one has said anything because we just forget about it. But for the past like two months now, these stickers have the bottom has been cut off. I think it's just a, an error with um, printing. So I definitely will let Shan know because you can see the bottom of the design right there. It's really not a big deal, but um, I'm sure she would like to know that that is cut off because she may not know that. Um, and then these are all good. These you can use for um, paying bills, for payday, hydration trackers, Trash day, I use that one all the time. Laundry, I use that bill do. Workout, it's the weekend, happy mail, payday. The honeybee shop release, which I love. Uh, do the chores. And then we have the actual date covers, the numbers for the date covers. 
which you can see that they are round and they will fit right in here, which is very satisfying. <laughs> and then, oh, we have our little planner cart and it's got a couple of the little peas on it. And it's got a little phone up here and pens, some planners here. So cute, so cute. I tend to kind of hoard these uh, planner carts and I've definitely, I want to start um, making them into like bookmarks because they're just really cute, but you could just use it on your planner layout, you know, as a, just a giant sticker. Um, and then you have, so this is the Hobonichi kit. I don't have a Hobonichi, but I use these all the time in my catch-all, um, which is a nine disc planner, just disbound planner. Um, and so you have Monday through Sunday on here. And sometimes I like to use this, depending on which layout I'm using, um, I like to use this as kind of like a weekly overview to write, you know, uh, appointments for that week or events uh, for my job and things like that. So I do like that. Um, then we have some little baby checklists, which always come in handy. Love, again, black and white stripe. You could do a black and white stripe theme book and I, or uh, bait box. Like just the whole thing is black and white stripe. I'd be down with that. Uh, <laughs> and then we are down to, I think the last page. Oh no, last two pages. Um, then we have, you'll recognize these from the die cuts, same designs, but we have them. They're smaller. You can use them in your planner. And oh, you get more of these girls are my favorite. I love the little angry pea, find your inner peas. And that's it. That is a sticker book. So let's recap. All right, guys. So that is this month's Bay Box. This is for August 2021. And again, the theme is planner royalty. Um, I am definitely in love with this box. It is not... Um, not my favorite bait box ever. Y'all know that my favorite's always gonna be Personality Crisis 2.0, unless she comes out with a Gamer Girl box, which will just be too much to handle. But <laughs> this is definitely one of my favorites. I really like it. I think it's, it's very classy uh, while still being cute. It's definitely not my like everyday vibe. Um, clearly, if you subscribe to my channel and you, you know, know kind of what my style is. I like a lot of like creepy and cute kind of things. Um, just this washi roll here just kind of sums up my planning style, but I definitely do like this a lot. And I really like this. This is much higher quality than I thought it would be. Um, it just feels really, really nice. And I think this would be great to have. Again, it's something I, I don't really have a luggage tag like this. And you don't have to use it as a luggage tag. You could just use it on your purse, like I said, um, to, you know, just if you want to hold a little bit of cash in here or your card or whatever. Definitely cool. Something different. Um, I love the journaling cards. The sticker book is my favorite. I love the sticker book. Obviously, I love the die cuts. The washi's really cute. The little peas are really cute. The papers, everything's very pretty. Um, yeah, so great Great bait box, great quality. Love it as usual. So yeah, let me know, did you get this bait box? If you did, what do you think of it? If you did not, still, what do you think of this based on the video? Let me know in the comments. Let me know what is your favorite thing from this whole unboxing. Again, mine has to be the sticker book because it's, it's just gorgeous. I just, I can't wait to use it on the black paper. I think it's going to be so pretty. And definitely uh, subscribe to the channel if you have not. I would really appreciate it. Uh, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Be sure to follow me over on Instagram at Planning with Cass. Check out my podcast, Pixels and Planners. I have a Patreon. You can uh, sign up for as little as $2 per month to support the channel. All tiers of my Patreon, every uh, person will get early access to my YouTube videos, so you will see my videos before anyone else. Um, and I also, at the $8 tier, I will send you some physical stickers in the mail that are all original designs by me. So um, definitely check that out if you're interested in further supporting me, but if you are just watching the video, you are supporting me. So thank you. I appreciate you. 
I hope you are having a great day. I hope you have a great rest of your day. And I will see you next time. Bye.